Hello everyone, I am Takayuki, a researcher at AIST. I will talk about our paper, Content-Based Music Image Retrieval Using Self and Cross-Model Feature Embedding Memory. Content-Based Music Image Retrieval is a task which retrieves images that match a query music audio signal without any metadata, such as music gen tags. For example, Given a pack music auto signal as a query and a set of images as an image dataset, this task aims to retrieve images that match the query music auto signal from the dataset. To achieve content-based music image retrieval, we adopt a deep metric learning approach. Deep metric learning is a technique that embeds content into the same high-dimensional space. Each arrow indicates a content encoder and each point indicates an embedding of contents. For our tasks, we train two encoders that respectively embed music audio signals and images in the high-dimensional space. We call this space the shared embedding space. While training, we assume that a pair of a music audio signal and an image for the same song, that is, an original music image pair, is positive, and a pair of those for different songs is negative. The encoders are trained so that the embeddings of a positive pair are close to each other and those of a negative pair are far from each other in the shared embedding space. The key to successful deep metric learning is to mine informative pairs so that a loss function returns meaningful feedback to the encoders. Thanks to informative pairs, the embeddings of a positive music image pair lie close to each other and those of a negative pair lie far from each other in the shared embedding space. The bottleneck of deep metric learning in the content-based approach is that encoders can mine a few informative positive pairs. In this case, only an original music image pair can be a positive pair. To overcome this bottleneck, we propose a self- and cross-model feature embedding memory mechanism. Self- and cross-model feature embedding memory stores both the music and image feature embeddings of arbitrary previous iterations in memory. The embeddings stored in the memory can be used directly while training. This mechanism enables the encoders to mine more informative positive pairs in addition to informative negative pairs from the memories. That is, Assuming that every pair between the embeddings of a music audio signal and an image are a current iteration and their own stored embeddings is positive. Our mechanism enables the encoders to obtain additional informative positive pairs. This mechanism can be seamlessly integrated into a pair-based deep metric learning framework and can perform with a small amount of computational resources. The method using our proposed mechanism outperforms the other methods on the ranking-based evaluation metrics. Please come to our post too for the details. Thank you.